Hello everyone, welcome back to Ask Us Anything. Thanks for all your questions this month. Let's get started. Our first question this month comes from Lewis. He's asking, what are the best songs for a beginner drummer to play that are in the 4-4 time signature? Um, I use a couple of styles really, pop and rock. Beginning with pop, uh, a classic um, is Billie Jean by Michael Jackson. That's a really good one to get your teeth stuck into. Um, more modern, you can be looking at uh, Treasure by Bruno Mars. And from a rock perspective, you could maybe look at Back in Black by ACDC. And a little bit more heavy going, you could be looking at uh, Enter Sandman by Metallica. Hope that helps for you. Um, see you next time. Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, our next question comes from Mike McCallisey asks, singing and playing together, um, how to be a successful busker. So I'm guessing you're looking for a few tips how to sing and play together, and uh, I'll see if I can answer your question on busking. So tip one I would go for is make sure when you're practicing uh, singing and playing that your rhythm is simple at first. Pick a song that's really simple, nice and easy to play, so no complicated rhythms, no too many ups and downs, no funk, just nice and simple. Uh, tip two, my second tip would be when you pick a song, make sure you're practicing slow and you're singing and playing at a nice reasonable slow tempo, then slowly build it up so it's a comfortable pace. Uh, my tip three uh, is pick a song that you're going to play your rhythm in sync with your words. So. For example, a good choice would be Wow Thing. So for example, you've got Wow Thing. So basically as you're strumming, you're hitting the same rhythm as your lyrics. That's a good way to practice. But bear in mind, it took me probably a few years. I was a good, competent player before I could even sing myself and play at the same time. So don't worry if it feels like it takes ages to maybe develop your, your technique, basically. just you want your rhythm to be sort of automatic as you're doing it. Um, but anyway, don't worry too much about it. Just do it slow, easy rhythm at first, nice simple rhythm. And maybe pick a song that's your lyrics match the, the rhythms of your strumming. Okay, so busking. Um, being a successful busker, that's kind of a hard question. I guess that depends on where you're going to play. If you're going to play in the city centre, obviously the best time. You need the weather. You need peak time, like a peak day. Maybe you need a license to do that. Um, you need to be good with crowds. I see the best buskers if you go to Manchester, Liverpool or London, always seem to be very good with crowds. They can get people in, you can get people listening, maybe involve a few of the audiences. Um, and I think to them, it's not really about the money. And that's the most important thing. If you're there thinking, oh, I'm gonna make, I wanna make 50 quid today, um, by busking, that's not how it works. I think people go there more for like a reputation boost or maybe get their confidence up. That's how you should look to be a successful busker. Um, but yeah, that's it. Thanks for your question. See you next time. Thanks again for all your questions. See you next month.